I'm not using the one that sets it faster. Okay. Why not? I guess that's fine too. So this one you can just tell. Yeah, none of Hag's normal add-ons are bad. The purple and pink one, it arguable. I mean, this one is really good. This one's really good. Arguable, 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 arguable. But um, so anyway, uh, my terror radius is gonna be super small. Hag's already 24 base, I believe. Yeah, 24 base. So this makes it 16 meters. Very small terror radius. It's like a tier two Myers normally, not a tier two Myers with monitor. Um, just save the best for last, you know, it lets you smack and then teleport right away after, and then barbecue and pop have their synergy of knowing which one to go for. I don't like that there's somebody with a flashlight. That's potentially game ruining for hag, but it, it depends on how good the person is. Yeah. <coughs> Oh, okay, so they're... What, what are the hidden ones for Survivor? Just the ones that make you either spawn all together or two together, right? Um, Corrupt Intervention, I don't like on Hag because it brings them to you faster, and you kind of need a little bit of time. You don't need, like, the full two minutes that Corrupt would be up, but you need a little bit of time at the beginning with Hag to set up some traps. Um... Normally my first trap is like I'll spawn and just set a trap just because like it's it's sometimes in a good spot, sometimes not. Um, but if it's right where I spawn, it's at least a little bit random, so the survivors aren't going to be looking there. for Like, they're not going to be expecting it, which in itself makes it a good trap a little bit. Okay, <coughs> not a great killer map in general. It can be pretty good for Hag, just because, um, you know, there's not a lot of line of sight for people to see you set up the traps. Uh, we're going to put this one right here, so that they're already in, like, they're already kind of committed. And then that one there. Um, survivors really like looping around this, so that should be good. I also like dropping out of that window. Wait, where? Okay. That'll work. Nobody drop this? Okay. That was... The shaking made that a lot worse. That was really risky. Yeah, barbecue on hag is purely for the blood points. Like, there is... Like, if you trap a hook especially. Yeah, which I didn't do, but... There we go. Um, like you're just gonna be looking down a lot. Hey, how are you? Oh. Hello there. All right. Um, I'll risk the DS. Why not? You gonna DS me? No. All right, yeah, run into one of those two traps, come on. Wait. Oh. Ah, I shouldn't have broken that. Okay, but now I know she is going this way down the stairs. Ah, uh, what? That was not close enough to stun me, but whatever. 
I'm losing momentum here. Not good. Where the hell is she? Oh well, forget it. I can't keep looking for her. Shit. Uh, yeah, no, that was a big... Yeah, no, I fucked up big time right there. That was a huge fucking waste of time. I want to kick that just to make sure nobody comes by and taps it to complete, but if I can get a pop off, it'll be better. Okay, they are on that gen there. God damn it. Oh, oh, they have life. Oh, okay. Well, good news is the god paladin here has already been thrown. And I'm at eight stacks. I haven't even seen the obsession then, right? Is that what that means? Oh shit, she's dead? I did not realize that. I'm opening this for me. I don't know if it'll give them better loops or not, but I'm used to it being open from the way the map used to look. So for my own sanity, I'm breaking that. Where the f fuck? Oh my god. Okay, no, I'm not going to waste time looking for hiding survivors again. I'm also not going to bother with that basement one unless they finish another gen. Okay, here's the obsession. Okay, it's Billiam. So that kind of sucks. That, uh... Mm, that I lost stacks, but... They don't seem to be on any gens at the moment. Unless they're on that one. That one would have been close enough for me to not see with barbecue. Did she have dead hard? Oh, fucking A. Are you kidding me? Meg, you can't really crouch when you know that I know you're there. Like, you can, but it, it just makes you look stupid. Can I pick this Meg up, please? Thank you? Okay. I think the teleport prompt was popping up, and I just saw, oh, second prompt, and thought it was the pickup. So Bill sees that one, it feels like. It's 
So yeah, I think Bill's going for this gen here based on how he was crouching. Well, I might as well. Yeah, oh, wait a minute. Spamming that control. I don't know if that got the pop off. Hey, Megs. Um, yeah, I just, she's the one who just got unhooked, so I'm going to slug her. And the other Meg probably went down here. Or not down there, but just... Mm. Thank you, window trap. Oh, oh, wherever that is, that's where Bill's at. Okay, okay. All right. Oh, the other person can still Kobe, but... Uh, I'm I'm willing to let them if they manage. Yeah, no, the the other the meg that's already hooked. Not this one, that one. That meg there kind of ruined their Oh, she Kobe? No, Bill had unbreakable. I should have expected unbreakable specifically on a Bill. But that meg right there. Um she didn't throw the game, but she's the reason that uh, the ending happened like this. When she ran into body block, that was stupid of her. I was going to slug that other Meg regardless, because I just kind of assumed she'd have DS. Um, which I don't know if she did. But I was going to act as if she did either way. Um, so when she ran into body block, it, it gave me a free injure. Um, and it was like, she was loud she was injured so I could track her down pretty easy and um, yeah that is why I was able to down her because she fucking ran in front of the other mech okay and then that's gonna be my last game for this stream because uh, we're gonna be setting sail in a minute oh that's the only person who can see me so I guess the GG doesn't mean much oh they had a, an auto heal I don't know oh that was probably the bill Maybe. 